The video poses the rhetorical question of evil or good. The queen would stand before her magic mirror and ask, mirror, mirror on the wall, who is the fairest of them all? And the mirror would always reply, you, my queen, are the fairest in the land. Let me see thy face. What wouldst thou know, my queen? Magic mirror on the wall, who is the fairest one of all? myself and see my heart is black no colors anymore i want them to turn black Over time, the evil queen's obsession with psychedelics grew, and her behavior became increasingly erratic and unpredictable. She retreated deeper into her own mind, lost in a world of her own creation. The evil queen became more and more consumed by her own beauty and power. She became jealous of Snow White's beauty and youth. Bags cannot hide her gentle grace. Alas. She is more fair than thee. Alash for her. Reveal her name. The psychedelics had given her a new perspective on life. The story of Snow White is often told from the perspective of the titular character, but in this retelling, the focus is on the evil queen. As we've seen, the queen's obsession with her own beauty and power led her down a dark path, culminating in her attempt to kill Snow White. The queen's obsession with her own beauty and power led to her downfall. She was consumed by her own narcissism, and could not see the beauty in the world around her. She was left alone, with only her magic mirror, to keep her company, and she realized too late what she had lost. As philosopher Friedrich Nietzsche once said, he who fights with monsters should look to it that he himself does not become a monster. This quote is connected to the evil queen's character, as she became consumed by her own ego and narcissism to the point where it consumed her entirely. She continued to explore the magic of psychedelics.
One of the most influential philosophers of the 20th century, Friedrich Nietzsche, wrote extensively about the nature of good and evil, and the role of the individual in creating their own values. He argued that morality is not an objective or universal standard, but a human invention that reflects our instincts, desires, and power relations. He also warned against the dangers of conformity, herd mentality, and resentment, which can lead to the repression and distortion of our creative and vital energies. Nietzsche's ideas have inspired many artists, including some of the most iconic villains in popular culture, who challenge the status quo and embrace their own will to power. Snow White's journey led her to the home of the Seven Dwarfs, who became her friends and protectors. Together, they faced many challenges, including the arrival of the evil queen and her cursed apple. The apple, it turned out, contained a powerful drug that was intended to keep Snow White in a state of perpetual sleep, a fate worse than death. Sleeping death. Oh, one taste of the poisoned apple, and the victim's eyes will close forever in the sleeping den. In conclusion, the villain's journey is not just a narrative trope, but a reflection of the human condition, the struggles, and the potentials that we all face. By understanding the psychological, philosophical, and artistic aspects of this journey, we can gain a deeper insight into ourselves, our society, and our culture. We can also appreciate the creativity, the complexity, and the diversity of the human imagination, which allows us to explore and express our deepest fears, desires, and aspirations. The video poses the rhetorical question of evil or good. To explore the limitations that affect those who have suffered and found peace within themselves.
you for watching TomTom Studio, where we bring you the latest updates and insights on various topics. We appreciate your support and would like to encourage you to engage with our content by subscribing, commenting, sharing, and liking. By subscribing to our channel, you will never miss an update and be notified whenever we post new videos. Your comments and feedback help us improve our content and provide you with the information you are looking for. Sharing our videos with your friends and family helps us reach a wider audience and spread the knowledge. Finally, hitting the like button lets us know that you enjoyed our content and motivates us to continue creating more informative and engaging videos. Your support is invaluable to us, and we look forward to your continued engagement with our channel. Thank you for watching and being a part of TomTom Studio community.